birthday, everybody. Um, first of all, it's official. My daughter has got everybody in my house sick. Thanks, Brooke. <laughs> um, so it's Thursday and it's time for V-Day number 16. I do have to say one thing. Uh, my sister's birthday tomorrow, and this is my youngest sister, and she will be, I believe, 13. You won't quote me on it because I'm totally not 100% sure, but that just totally makes me like, holy cow, and happy birthday, sister. Um, so today, I wanted to do a video about, I know I'm a mom because, and the reason I want to do this is because with Brooke being sick, you know, she's got boogers and congestion and, you know, icky, nasty stuff. And I did something that I saw my mother do all the time and was like, ow, oh my god, that's disgusting. And I just did it and thought nothing about it and totally went on with my life. And so the reason I want to do that is because I'm sure a lot of you other moms have done it as well and you're like, holy crap. So today's video is going to be, I knew I was a mom. So, I mean, obviously we all knew we were mothers when we were carrying our children and how our lives changed after we had our children, but what about the little things that changed after you have your baby? You know, everybody says that if it, your babies spit, poop, or throw up, you're okay with it. And I think that's true. Coming from someone who hates spit, poop, or throw up, she um, totally doesn't care about it now. And that's attested this past week. Uh, I remember when Brooke was brand new and I was half asleep at 3 a.m. changing her diaper and she started to poop and she didn't, I didn't want her to poop on my bed. So I stuck out my hand and I caught her poop. Embarrassing moment. Yes. But I did not give two stinks about it. I casually wiped it off my hand and put it in the diaper. And so, um, another one is I pick my daughter's boogers out of her nose and kind of wipe them on my pants and just go about my day like nothing went wrong. Usually this is when I'm at home. Granted, if I'm going out somewhere, I don't do it because I want to look a little presentable. Um, I know another one was, I remember Bree and I talked about, we didn't want to be those moms that, you know, was like looked super lazy and, and didn't do her hair or got short mom haircuts because it was convenient. Well, I've become that mother that puts her hair up in a, in a ponytail or doesn't put her makeup on. I, I mean, I still try to do that, but that's what really made me realize I was a mom when I started being like, oh, I'm going to go to Walmart. Well, my hair is in a mess, and I have makeup smeared from three days ago, and I just kind of walk out the door, and I'm like, meh, whatever. <laughs> uh, I There's tons of them, and you know, because I'm filming my video, my mind is blank. But I know, like, boogers. And I remember my daughter threw up um, last week because... She was coughing so much, she just threw up this, this it was um, a combination of a french fry and mucus, so it was mucusy french fry, and I just kind of, I had her on my chest, and she threw up down my, my chest, and I just was like, it's okay, just do it, honey, it's okay, and I didn't give two shits about it, I just kind of wiped it off, or, you know, if it's 3 a.m., and you baby accidentally pees on the bed you kind of soak it up a little bit and then you just go back to bed if it's not interfering with your husband or your child who, who cares you're a mom uh that being said i do really try to take care of myself and my house is routinely cleaned and my sheets are routinely cleaned but you know what um pardon my french but shit happens literally uh when you're a mom Things just happen, and there's nothing you can do about it. Granted, you know, if your little one is sick and puking, and they're puking every two minutes, you're not going to get to clean up your piles every two minutes. 
you know, you're going to do 60 loads of laundry, or you're going to be so tired you don't care, and you're just going to let the pee be on your side of the bed, because you know what? I'm taking a shower in the morning anyways, I'll do laundry. So, yeah. <laughs> that is V-Day number 16, and I want to know down below what, um was the thing that made you really realize, oh my god, I know I'm a mom now. Uh, so yeah, uh, we'll see you tomorrow, Brie, and we'll see all of our other viewers later. Bye!